Hey, what's up guys? I'm back with a brand new video. You guys remember I made a video a couple of weeks ago showing off how to enable the hidden LED notification on the whole of the Galaxy S10 family through a third-party application. And I talked about the Samsung will be bringing its own official LED fix for this and seems like they have thanks to the good luck application i did talk about what good luck app is uh, how it does the customization the type of features it provides if you want to know how to install these i do have a video that i did last year so the process is similar to that i will leave the link in the description for that as well so for those who don't know good luck application actually allows more customization on the one ui one ui is a very simple software it has very less bloatware it works really really good but for those who want more customization option uh, they can try out the good Lock app and now but now with the one ui and the galaxy s10 we have some new additions to the one ui customization so first up we have the nice shot uh, feature which basically allows you to take a screen recording off your screen of course from anywhere so you don't have to install a third-party application or anything like that it just works uh, flawlessly you have a couple of options to change the screen recording functions such as regarding the sound or not you can also change the video quality size from high to low if you want to save more size as well as changing the format of the screenshots if you want png you can do that or you can have it on the default so the way it works is pretty simple all you have to do is to go ahead and take a screenshot which you normally do and once you do that you see two buttons here so you press this one it basically starts uh, recording the screen so it's pretty simple you can move this around it doesn't really appear so now it's actually recording in full uh, high quality 60 frames per second and once i'm done i can just press the stop key and it gets saved to my gallery directly and here i can basically play and you can see it's a high quality screenshot with no lag whatsoever so pretty much on every screen anywhere pretty much anywhere you can do that in native screen recording option via good log application now the next app on the list is called as noise start and as the name suggests it has something to do with the notification so this is a brand new notification panel system you can say it's got more of an expanded look and it also allows you to snooze your notification for up to seven days which is pretty cool now in order to activate this you have to have the uh, good log app installed on your phone so uh, again check the link in the description i have a video that i made previously the setup is very similar to that i'll drop the latest link for the good Lock app 2019 in the description as well as links for these applications now the main one the main fun one which most people are interested in and that is the edge lighting plus so this allows you to have colorful ring around the cutout and it looks amazing it is by god one of the coolest things on the new phones of these days. I just love the design because of this particular feature. So this application is called as Edge Lighting Plus and as the name suggests, it has uh, some new plus features with the edge lighting. If you go into effects, you get all of your uh, basic, your normal effects that goes around the edge that you normally see. Some of them are of course new here. They have some new additions. You can change the color, width, transparency. You have the option for uh, looping as well. It looks really cool like that. But then you have Eclipse option, which works around the cutout. It will work on the S10, S10 Plus, Galaxy S10e as well. So you can basically go to color tab and uh, check out different colors. Uh, no problem. You can have pink, yellow, blue it's like magic you know it works with every single color and for those who didn't follow my third party app tutorial i think this one will be more convincing i guess you can also set out the duration for your notification now since this is an edge lighting feature your phone has to be on the sleep mode or you can say just you know the normal resting mode so every time you're going to get the notification instead of the edge of the display lighting up your cutout would light up and show you the notification light now last but not the least there has been a new major update to improve the speed of the in-display fingerprint scanner as you guys have probably seen in my speed test video against huawei b30 pro the fingerprint scanner on the s10 plus is no doubt next level of technology but it is kind of slow maybe it's because of the animation or something so samsung has actually fixed this issue in the latest april security patch now i haven't received the update yet but it has set to improve the speed of the fingerprint scanner massively so so if anyone out there has the update you can share your thoughts in the comment section below 
And that's all for this video. If you guys enjoyed this, give this video a thumbs up. In case you don't know, I am giving away two Galaxy Buds. If you want to enter, make sure to subscribe to the channel. Follow me on my Instagram and Twitter. And lastly, leave a comment on my giveaway announcement video. Link is down below in the description. With that being said, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.